Hey, it's Ian from 1031 Jack FM, and we are about to surprise the Pollard family with an amazing Christmas. Last week, I talked to Carrie Pollard, who, first of all, is the most amazingly positive person I have ever talked to in my entire life. She's a single working mother. She has two children, Gabriel, who's 12, and Ava, who is 10. She also supports her mom, who has MS. Her son, Gabriel, eight years ago, was diagnosed with muscular dystrophy. This year, they're retrofitting their house to fit Gabriel's needs, so they've been displaced and are living in a trailer. So, Carrie, who again is a single working mother, has to pay for the house, she has to pay for her mom to stay somewhere, and she has to pay for this trailer, which means Christmas wasn't going to be the greatest this year. And I say wasn't because you guys stepped up huge. This is going to be an amazing surprise we have for them, and I can't wait. Well, let's not keep you in the rain any longer. Okay. Yes, let's. let's start walking. Come with me. Uh, Are you guys ready? Hang on, hang on. Sort of. This is just um, uh, just some gift cards. There's hundred dollars to Walmart. There's some country grocery. There's five hundred dollars in thrifty foods in here, and a thousand dollars cash just to do it with whatever you like. Don't fall down now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Um, our friends at the Parkside Spa probably <laughs> thought that you don't take a lot of time for yourself. <laughs> So they want to treat you to a four-hour uh, spa day. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah. Ava, um, <laughs> our friends at the Victoria Music Conservatory heard that you like to sing. Do you? Yeah. And you're in the school choir, right? Yeah. So they're giving you a semester of singing. Yay! <laughs> you so wanted to have that. <laughs> Enjoy. Oh, and that you have this room. You'll wake up Christmas morning here. The Hotel Grand Pacific has decided they don't want you to stay in the trailer over Christmas. Uh, that's that's no way to spend the holidays. So this is this is all yours, and they want you to enjoy it and and just have a merry Christmas. Yay! Thank you for starting that. Thank you so much for doing that for us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gotta save some presents for Christmas. I think there is every Lego ever built there for you. Can I open this one? You, you can, that's up here. That's up here. Oh, it's Lego. Ava, it's the Lego movie back up there. I shouldn't have bought you that. It's good. Well, it's not a small gesture. It's huge because. For somebody to think about doing something for somebody else, you can't just stop there. You just have to you have to go and, and do that. You have to follow through. And for people to follow through at this time of year is astounding. And uh, it means a lot for us to know that other people care. They don't have to they don't have to, you know, know us, but it's nice that other people care about children that are going through these kinds of things and you know, this is wonderful and we really appreciate it.